Ladies and gentlemen, Vidyaniketan Group of Institutions welcomes you to yet another season of India Insight. Envisioned by Mrs. Prema Rajagopal, the founder of this institution, way back in 2004, the objective ever since has been to enhance the knowledge of India and appreciate the diverse culture of this nation. As our young children take part from various corners of the world, over the last couple of years in the digital avatar, this contest has reached over 20,000 students across 10 countries. We at the Vidyaniketan Group of Institutions truly appreciate and acknowledge the support and patronage given to us by all the participating schools, their teachers and managements. Before we begin, it is our pleasure and privilege to invite a well-known educator and a passionate teacher from the Vidyaniketan group of institutions, a teacher who has grown to become the principal of this institution. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Miss Vasuma Achar. Dear viewers, heritage is legacy that transcends from one generation to another. It is not an easy endeavor to comprehend the enormous wisdom that exists manifold about a country. India Insight Quiz is one step towards bringing this wisdom to the students who are the beacons to a prosperous future. Srimati Prima Raj Gopal, a great visionary and the backbone of our institution, gave great importance to values, culture, heritage and ethics. Prima Ma'am's qualities of leadership, integrity and commitment towards education play a phenomenal role not just imparting a means for living, but also a medium to foster critical thinking and instill values in generations to come. India Insight Quiz is a part of the dream envisaged by Prema Man to transform today's learners into architect of, of a promising future. Because the future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of these dreams. Good luck to all the participants. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's my privilege to introduce our host for the day. Rashmi is currently Asia's only professional lady quiz host, an alumnus of the prestigious NITK Suratkal and I am Calcutta. She has hosted close to a thousand shows across India, Singapore and several countries across the Middle East. She is the only woman to have been invited to host a quiz at Kuwait for the last five years. She was recognized by Business World as 40 under 40 as a personality from India to reckon with. She was the winner of the Quiz Host of the Year 2022 by SMX Leadership Summit. She's been part of this quiz for many years as she has been part of several quizzes such as Tata Crucible, the Union Bank Quiz, the Rural IT Quiz, TCS Inquisitive, just to name a few. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get started. Time to welcome your host, Miss Rashmi Futado. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the India Inside Quiz 2023, the junior category. India Inside Quiz started way back in 2004 and today India Inside has evolved to be a larger platform with quiz, drawing and debates, a debate contest for across all age groups. We have had a lot of participation this year as well. I mean, the story continues year after year. We have had wonderful participation. And the participation is global, not only restricted to our country. This is, of course, the junior category of the India Inside Quiz. 
So let me get started with this quarter final, the first quarter final, by introducing all of our finalists here today. Our first finalist joining us from Jaipur is Samyak Jain from the Cambridge Court High School. Following him from Cambridge Court High School, Jaipur again is Devyaraj. Up next from Dr. Virendra Swaroop Education Center, Kanpur is Samrat. Representing the Sri Sri Ravi Shankar Vidya Mandir, Bengaluru is Shravan. Representing the Freedom International School, Bengaluru is OAS. And completing the lineup for us here today, a lone lady trying to take it forward for all of us girls from Presidency School, Artinagar, Bengaluru, is Jotsna. So these are our finalists here today, ladies and gentlemen. Let me quickly tell you what's going to happen in this quarter final. I have 10 questions for them. Nothing is going to appear on their screen. They have to listen to me very carefully. Their scoring pattern is going to be plus one if they get it right and minus one if they get it wrong. Only the top four scorers will move forward to the semi-final of the India Inside Quiz in the junior category. So their goal today is not necessarily to win the quarter-final, but to be among the top four scorers who will make it to the next level, that's the semi-final of the India Inside Quiz. So let's see what happens. Our contestants are well aware of the rules, remaining rules. So we'll get started with the quarterfinal, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get started with the first quarterfinal of the India Inside Quiz for the junior category. Question number one, here we go. Which is the only Indian city to be named after a businessman? And, oh, Samrat, go ahead. He doesn't need options. Samrat, you are on the buzzer. You have pressed the buzzer. Go ahead. Jamshedpur. Samrat getting a plus one on that, ladies and gentlemen. All right, let's move on to the next question, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Also known as the Lachen Palkar Palace, it is a former royal palace in Ladakh built by King Senge Namgyal. What am I talking about? Or which palace am I talking about? I'll help you. Oh, Devira doesn't need options. I was about to give options. Go ahead. I think, I think it is Leh Palace. Leh Palace is absolutely right. Devira is getting a plus one on that, ladies and gentlemen. Let's move on to the next one. Question number three. Here we go. Which state's film industry is called Tollywood? I'll help you out. I have options for you. Kerala or Telangana? Jotsna, go ahead. Um, Telangana. Telangana is absolutely right. She's getting a plus one on that. Let's move on to the next question, ladies and gentlemen. Question number four. Here we go. Which was India's first indigenously made color film? Your options, Janzir or Kisan Kanya. Oh, no one going on. This. Oh, Jotsna, go ahead. Um, Kisan Kanya. Kisan Kanya. Kisan Kanya is absolutely right. Jotsna getting a plus one on that. Question number five. Here we go. Who was the first sports person to win the Bharat Ratna? Go ahead. Deviraj is trying. Ma'am, I think it is Sachin Tendulkar. Sachin Tendulkar is absolutely right. Getting a plus one on that is Divya Raj. Moving on to the next question. Question number six. Here we go. Who was the last Viceroy of India? We all study about this in our school. Go ahead, Oes. He's trying. Ma'am, Lord Mountbatten. 
Lord Mountbatten is absolutely right. O is getting a plus one on that. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll finish two more questions and then let you know what the scores are. Let's move on to question number seven. Here we go. In which city did the revolt of 1857 begin? Deviraj, go ahead. Ma'am, Meerat, Uttar Pradesh. Meerat is absolutely right. Meerat is all I required. Plus one to Deviraj on that. All right. Three more questions to go, ladies and gentlemen. I told you all in the very beginning that top four contestants will go through to the semi final. Let's move on to question number eight. Here we go. I have options for you in case you want the options. A UNESCO World Heritage Site, this was the capital of the famed Vijayanagara Empire. Jyotsna, go ahead. Hampi. Hampi is absolutely right. Jyotsna getting a plus one on that, ladies and gentlemen. Scores, ladies and gentlemen. Jyotsna and Diviraj both on three points each. Samrat and OS on one point each. Samyak and Shravan are yet to score. They are on nil. But believe me, at a quarterfinal like this, nil is not a bad place to be. If they were on negatives, then they would have to work harder to move into the positives. Now, only if they get one answer right, they can move into the positive and at least challenge for a tiebreaker. So let's see what happens. The penultimate question of this quarterfinal. Here we go. Who is fondly known as the Paioli Express? Your options. Oh, Jyotsna doesn't need options. Go ahead. P.T. Usha. P.T. Usha is absolutely right. Jyotsna getting another plus one. The last question of this quarter final. Here we go. Who is considered the father of experimental fluid dynamics in India? I have a clue for you. The Indian Satellite Launch Center at Sri Harikota is named after him. Go ahead, Jyotsna. Satish Dhawan. Satish Dhawan is absolutely right. Jyotsna getting another plus one on that. Ladies and gentlemen, the final scores of the first quarter final of the India Inside Quiz in the junior category. Here we go. All right. Jyotsna. Uh, from Presidency School, RT Nagar, Bengaluru is on 5 points and Divya Raj from Cambridge, Cambridge Court High School, Jaipur is on 3 points. Both of them make it to the semi-final of the India Inside Quiz Fair and Square and joining them with 1 point each are Samrat from Dr. Virendra Swaroop Education Centre, Kanpur and OS from Freedom International School, Bengaluru. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, our four finalists who have now moved into the semi-final, Deviraj, Chotsna, Oase and Samrat. Ladies and gentlemen, don't go anywhere. We have the second quarterfinals coming up and I hope to see you in that quarterfinals as well. You take care.